Hi, my name is Randall Cook, and today we are going to be reviewing the Electric Flopping Fish Cat Toy. All right, uh, it's a USB rechargeable, uh, funny and interactive toy simulated fish for pet cat kitten. <laughs> Just love those descriptions. Um, let's see. Let's get some more details on this. Um, uh, moving cat kicker fish toy with built-in touch sensor. When your kitty touches the toy, it will automatically move and swing and make a sound, attracting your cat to play, kick, and attack. Uh, I know cats love an attack. Um, also, you can flip the wagging fish toy in the air so your cat can jump and catch it. Enhance the interaction and relationship between you and your cat. Well, I like to see that. All the cats I had were little boogers. Let's check out some questions. Uh, one question was, does this toy wiggle on its own? And the answer is, uh, turn the toy on. When your cat goes to play with and bite it, it will run automatically and stop if not being played with. And another question was, how long is the fish? And the answer is, this fish is 11 inches long. Well, hey, if I were to catch that in the ocean, I would keep it. Okay, let's move on to some reviews from previous perches. Flopping catfish. My cat loves this little fish. As long as the tail does not flick about, uh, she is afraid of it. For now, I keep it turned off. She seems to love rubbing against it and cuddling it. <laughs> well, don't we all? Uh, another reviewer was a uh, perfect distraction for my cat. Very cute and nice distraction. Uh, see when he's in his car and the cat can play with it so it doesn't bite or scratch him. That's a good thing, you don't want to be distracted while you're driving, because you're on your phone. This is a perfect fit for me and my cat. Makes spending time with my cat more fun. Aw, that was nice. All right, let's see what this thing can do. All right, just open up the plastic. Yes, I used my teeth. All right, very colorful fish. Kind of looks like a, maybe like a bass. I'm not sure. Um, and it comes with oh, I didn't see this. Comes with the charger. And uh, <laughs> I'm only guessing this is catnip. <laughs> Uh, I guess you can put the catnip in the zippered pouch along with the battery pack and the recharger. So I'm not sure if it's charged up yet. Let's see. Oh, yep. Well, there it goes. All right, we'll see how long it goes before it calms down. Uh, well, I don't know about cats, but my dog will love this one. All right, so, so I guess that's about eh, 10 seconds before it shuts off. So let's uh, hit it again. Oh, it's doing a different pattern this time. I think it's SOS. Help me. All right, so we'll just leave it. Uh, so it does seem to shut off after about Stop that. Stop it. Um, but anyways, uh, you got the USB charger. Um, and this is catnip. No, it's not what you're thinking. Keep your minds out of the gutter. And I guess you could just put the catnip in the pouch with it. Um, I don't see another spot for it to go. Um, anyways, this is a very cool toy. I know any cat would like freak out over this thing. 
um, and a dog as well. I can't wait to give it to my dog. I don't know how long it'll last with the dog, but it, for a cat, I think it'll last a long time. It's very nice, very soft. It's pretty much true to life looking. And it doesn't have that nasty fish smell. All right. All righty. We'll zip you back up. Um, so as you can see, it does come charged. Um, but uh, I'm not sure how long of a charge it has in it. I would obviously charge it up for a while. You know, usually these things take about, you know, an hour to fully charge. Um, and I think this is, a, this is an excellent toy.